wasn't on the money. Domeng picks that up, evades the man, gets it back. Domeng with a chance here, and there's the goal. It's Christophe Bovan makes it 3 1 to the Nottingham Panthers. It's the number 18 and another new guy. Yeah, and what a, what a three way pass and play by, by those three guys there. Domeng, great play to um, evade the icing and pick that puck up. Nice play down low, and then, uh, yeah, Boy Van just in front there to pop that one home. And I think all the uh, three French guys there connect. Deneen drops it off. Talbot Tassi tries to find a man around the back and then square across again. It was away from May. Tetlo towards the net, Headley's leg out. Talbot Tassi towards the net, and it's gone all the way in, has it? It looks like it has. And it's another goal for Christophe Bovan. No tip on that. 4-1. Yeah, great shot there from the point. When I first saw it, I thought maybe it did get a slight deflection. But like you said, I don't think he does. He just curls the top of the circle, fires that in. And yeah, John O'May there, the big body, just in front of the net, taking away Jordan Headley's eyes. And that one finds the back of the net. Yeah, I don't think anybody touched that. But you see May there right in his eye line. There's nothing he can see. And even though May may not get an assist, he probably should do for that one. Look at the Panthers fans going wild. Yeah. Another face-off win for the Panthers, but it's out of the reach of Tetlow, and it's got to be a long way away from him for that to be the case. <laughs> I was just going to say that, yeah. Panthers into the offensive zone, trying to square it, backhand oh. shot, and the save made by Bonner. Oh, oh, and then swept in. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, Puck has gone in. Nightmare start for Storm. Panthers lead early. Here's a great poke check. Uh, we'll see just coming up but we're on an extra slow-mo great poke check by Bonner there and but his that's just asleep there he just pops under his foot and loses it and it's the Pampers that are first to it and it comes in off the back of Bonner's pad so a bit of a sloppy goal really for the Manchester Storm Brinis Fenn Ellis has a man to the left, here is the shot, is the back door, surely it's going to go in finally. He's just about crossed the line, I think Shane Owen does have it in his glove. But the Panthers have got a goal and it's 1-2, Christophe Boivin with it. Yeah, it's a great play here. Right here, Matheson just waiting, waiting, waiting. A deflection right here, he goes to the net, stops and he just gets it over the line. <laughs> just. We'll take it, we'll take anything that comes. Oh. They've been playing well, and it's finally going to come. As, you know, they've been patient and a little turnover in the neutral zone for an odd man rush for the Nottingham Panthers, and they capitalize. We'll have a bit of a reset. Clavistad, Simmons there with him as well. And Maxime 48. Here is Simmons back into 48. Good work by Boivin to allow, not allow the shot to come straight in. It was past the post. Cangelosi. Panthers change the D man to Madison. There's the tip, and there's there the goal! Is. The Panthers have won it. It's Austin Cangelosi across to Christoph Boivin. It's 4 3 and two points and a win for the Panthers. Yeah, it's just a great play by right here. He just, he's just waiting, he's waiting. The defenseman just right here. He just beats this guy to the net, hits the goalie in the chest, and rolls right in. But a big victory for the Nottingham Panthers tonight. Yeah. Third goal of the Elite Series for Christophe Boivin and the most important yet, Sean Bonner, not very happy, but he did an excellent job all throughout the game for his Storm side. Now there are numbers here for the Steelers. Alden, Kirk coming in on the weak side, but nothing could do for Sonder Alden. Back to Connolly, and there is Kirk. Surely it's not gone in. Ben Bounds has either made a save or it's hit the post there, but it was an excellent chance for Liam Kirk. Domeng, now a chance the other way, straight through the legs of Pellini. Heavy shot from Boivin and it's snuck through. One end to the other, big save from Ben Bounds and it's gone through the legs of Ben Churchfield and the Panthers are two up. Yeah, and that's exactly what you, you know you need. Just like you said, huge save by Bounds at one end. Yeah. This line's been great for the Panthers so far with uh, Boivin, Polini and Deming. And he uh, returns the favour this time as Polini floats that one in. And Boivin doesn't miss there, just through the, through the five ball there of Churchfield. Trick forward. Beaudry, good work to 
almost dispossessing there by Brett Pellini. Boivant will close out there, but the pass comes forward. Jonathan Phillips is all alone. Far side square to Stenton. Pellini touches it on, gets away from Beaudry, and in comes Boivant. Maybe another one here for the pass. Jeremy Beaudry gets back very well. And almost keeps possession. Domingue, and there it is. It's another one. It was a broken play, but it's that line again. Christophe Boivant makes it four. Yeah, just like you said, that line again, just hustling outward from the Steelers. Uh, great play here. And again, just puck fired over by Domingue onto uh, Boban's stick. And yeah, you know as soon as he gets that puck, he's putting that high on the blocker side. Nothing Warburton could do. He gets across well there, but you know, this, this line at the moment is just tearing the Steelers to pieces. Mike Hammond, an important defensive zone draw. He can't win it. Shot straight off the draw. Rebound in front. It's in. It's muscled home. And finally, Headley is beaten. A big rebound. And the Nottingham Panthers level. Really unfortunate on Jordan Headley there. Thinks he's got it. And then just at that last second, it springs out in front. And then it's just controlled and put into the back of the net there. It took the Panthers 30 minutes to wipe out the lead first time and five minutes to do it second time with 4-4 as we enter three-on-three three overtime. You can just win a one-on-one -on -one battle somewhere. You create an odd man rush. And you can win the game straight away with Boivin. Just like that. As you do, there's your one-on-one -on -one battles. Two of them to beat McKiska on the speed and beat... Dr. Danielson driving the net and Churchfield not an awful lot of opportunity there as it's in the back of the net before the Steelers can do anything to get ready for it. 17 seconds into overtime for the game winner from the Nottingham Panthers from 3-0 down. They've won it 5-4 in overtime. You know, the likes of Duggan, Venus, Lacken and Ferreira, if they can get that secondary score, and obviously that was a power play goal, but if they can get more goals from their second third line, they're going to be really dangerous come playoff time. Bellini, Domeng, Boivin in the middle, can he find him back to Boivin? And there it is, straight leveller. Christophe Boivin with yet another goal. It's eight now for him in the tournament, one each. Yeah, and you've got Ferreira at one end, who we used to see in uh, scoring lots of goals, and then we come the other way, and again, it's that line, and... Uh, Deming there, he just seems to know where Bovan is every time and he throws that in front of Bovan there, just gets the depth of the touches and just lifts it just over Owen's glove. So all that hard work by the Blaze to get that power play goal is basically undone in the next shift. But 